hey, this is how we make a slide. So, what we need are a couple of skewers, a straw, and I'll, I will use some half popsicle sticks to get this thing going here. Now, the skewers can be cut down to the right length. Now, if you're in my classroom, just ask. There are tin snips in one part of the room, but if you use a, a big pair of scissors and get them right to the end here, what you can sometimes do is get them to cut pretty nicely. We also need a little bit of straw. Two of those. And our popsicle sticks. So the first thing we want to do is make the sled that's going to slide over and back on the on the slide. So I'm going to glue two these two bits of straw to these two popsicle sticks. Is that one any good? It is no good because it needs to be straight. If these aren't straight, it's not going to work as well. Here comes the second one. Now I'm putting the glue down and then I'm putting the straw on top. You're trying to get the glue in between. But sometimes if I want to make something extra strong, I might even glue a second popsicle stick on top. Or I may put glue, kind of like a bridge over the top, because that glue gets pretty strong. Next step in our slide is we're going to put these skewers in those two popsicle sticks. They're still cooling down. And the last step is simply to glue those down. Now you might say, should we leave a gap? <clears throat> you certainly can, but even with me pressing down on both sides, this thing slides really nicely. Just don't get any glue on the track, and it's perfectly fine. So here's the last step. And just like that, we've made the slide.